Okay, so let's try to use the Barbaric King because they just got a new buff on their third skill. A new effect, right? Berserk State. So let's do... I mean, this is Siege. I've done my Guild War. I can't bring them into Guild War. So let's try it in Siege. Uh, let's do this. We can still... Oh, this is gonna put bombs on me, but we have immunity, so we should be fine. Let's still put up immunity. We can steal it using the third skill. Seems perfect, right? So let's try it out. So we buff. Immunity. Attack. Um... Oh, wait. Let's push back this thing then. Yep. And then... We go this one. There's a berserk state. We go into this. That's the berserk state. Perfect. We're supposed to do more damage. 20 something K. Without without defense pick, is it? Oh it doesn't have immunity. So that's two. Uh, we might be in... Uh, is this... This is gonna move, right? So we attack with... Mm. Yo, this move will kill this. Let me push this back. And then we... Do this. We, we got the... Because we used the skill, we got... Oh, wait. They can cycle this, that means. Because he gains attack bar. I need a violent prop. You know? Because this gains attack bar. And then we can get this thing back again. And then we can keep getting this uh, berserk state. We do this. We push. We kill first. 28k on default. Without the oh no, that's a defense break. Right? Without attack buff, with defense break. I think I didn't pay attention. We do this. It's gonna do forty four k on one hit. Okay, that's pretty fun. Oh no, we we already use uh. We already use our strip and immunity, so we can't use the same thing, and we can't use uh, Azure again. This guy would be interesting too, because this skill you can just keep doing it over and over, and that means he will have the uh, berserk keeps happening, isn't it? It have 40% 40, 40 chance to proc this, right? Okay, so I need immunity. And let me think. But this is gonna be a problem, isn't it? Immunity and speed lead. Oh, how about we bring Mamir? Speed. But he's gonna move first. Attack, enemy target, defeat, distract, bar, and stunning it for two turn. Two turn stun. This, this is not a good, this is not a good defense to bring these two into, right? We're probably gonna be. I mean, oh, wait, hold on a second. Actually, we can do this one, I think. But with this, can we do it with this? You think? Does he have food? Okay, it's not fast. So if this move we can strip. Uh, we bring this and then we bring the this one. Let's try this. Does it make sense? How are we faster? Can we do this? Oh, that is not good. But, 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 but. This thing has defense break. So we try and then we, we proc. We don't have attack bar. Can we? We proc the frenzy. So we got a chance to move again. 
if we kill if we do this this can revive because this is a buff this is a recent buff okay oh my god i'm dumb my bad can't be revived if the the other has a reviving skill but it doesn't say it's about uh it doesn't <laughs> wait it can't be revived so that means passive it can't go through the passive that's a death resistance that's a death resistant uh thingy right if i have the fire one sutter will kill this and it can't be revived because it prevents death something i think is it right wait isn't it can't be revived usually works on the reviving thing huh i don't get it okay i got a violent prox or so attack buff immunity so oh wait no don't 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 do that uh we can't strip now because of that and he lost uh oh we're in trouble Come on, you need to proc. There you go. Oh wait, I I didn't proc the frenzy, but I used the frenzy, so I got the third skill again. Because just now I proc once, right? So I should heal up immunity, and then we do this to this thing. I didn't pay attention. How much damage did we do through that shield? Uh, we heal up immunity okay then we should do this 31k <laughs> without defense break <laughs> okay nice nice -er. uh i don't think we can okay how about we bring this into this right no 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 not this one this one will be destroyed we kind of need is there anyone else with um, immunity and attack buff? Oh wait, we can bring this actually. Well, immunity, but no attack buff. Yeah, it's fine. Let's do this. Let's try this. I feel like the... Um, what do you call that thing? This thing will move first. Oh wait, he doesn't move first. But he removed two buffs now. So that's not good. But we gotta do this to protect ourselves. Oh no. Okay. Uh, okay, this one. Attacks enemy, depleting his attack bar, stunning it for two turns. Stun for two turns. So we go for this. Stun it for two turns. So nice. And it's on berserk state. And we can kill. No, this one. The enemy defeated from this attack while your berserk cannot be re Oh, wait, this is the same thing. Wait. Dragon will, will ignore all effects that resist death. Will he come back? Eh, we just try. Why not? Wait. It comes back. It just prevent like uh, it's good for killing uh, tumors and Garo. I can't remember. Let's go for this. We gotta kill this before. Eh, 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 eh. Why did he change target? I don't get it. So we kill this. 28k without a tech buff. That is good. Okay, he put. He managed to put the bomb, but I think we should be able to win this unless this thing. Okay, okay, okay. We need to kill this. Can we kill this? Well, we can because now... Wait, actually, I don't need to use this skill. Right, I can save it. This will kill. Yeah, 17k without attack buff, without anything. And then we stun you for two turns. And we just kill with this. Oh, that thing do less damage now. I just realized that Musa is getting the, the buff. Uh, the buff, the nerf, right? Okay. Pretty fun, Berserk State. Okay, but we don't have any of those anymore. So that's kind of fun. The Berserk State thingy. Uh, K 
can I can can we use them in RTA? That is the question, right? But okay, this one has a high base hit points, which is nice. You want to ruin them still tanky because they're you're gonna lose their thirty percent hit points, thirty percent or max hit points when they are in uh, berserk state. Uh, this one is lower, but I don't think you're gonna use that. How about the? This is kind of interesting. Oh, this is high also, high base attack, so it can be used. Uh, because of this, stun for two turn. Uh, depleting attack bar, stunning for two turn goes under berserk, under berserk. Okay, okay, okay. And he has this branding and absorb attack bar. This is continuous damage, so he can stun for two turn while reducing the attack bar, but single target. But you have to use him with like a sort of a strip and then he move and it is stun one for two turns oh this is interesting this one is i feel like this could be usable also right because this has 40 percent chance to i mean an R rng units again 40 percent chance to you can actually if this proc you can keep having the berserk thingy right you're always in a state of berserk. And then this is... This is stun, disturb HP recovery... Cannot be revived also. This is good against Nana. Right? If you can kill... This is good against Nana. We just... Do this... If... The... Hopefully... I mean... Hopefully, I mean, it's kind of dumb. Hopefully this doesn't kill. You proc Frenzy, you get another turn. You don't use this skill, you use this skill to kill the unit so that against Nana team, they can't be revived. But this is like a lower, I mean, I mean not that low. It's only like 500 lower hit points. So you need him to be tanky also to do damage. But this will be better in violent. I just put this on rage to do more damage. But he could he should be better in violent because in on violent, if you proc this, um, then you can go a, a, a lot of uh, I mean uh, a lot of uh, turns. If you don't proc the frenzy, violent proc can proc. You can do this, and then this will be the this is in three turns. Wait, wait, this is three turns. Every. Did they are scale out in three turns? Oh yeah, three turns. So whenever the berserk and you can use it over and over again. I just realized that. Why am I so dumb? Didn't realize that this this is all in three turns when you max skill. So they will be in constant state of berserk because it is reusable in three turns. But the one that can proc more often is this guy. Because if you put him on violent, he can proc frenzy. If he doesn't proc the frenzy, you can proc the violent. And then you will have it in the next turn again, right? Three turns. You proc once. That means it's two turns. And then one more turn. You proc again, you have it again. Right? No. Three, you use it, it's become three turn. And then you proc it's two turn. You move one more time, you're gonna have it in one turn. Isn't it? Yeah. Okay, pretty fun, but I'm not sure whether they are usable in RTA. I have to try, especially this guy against Nana team. That will be interesting. But Surtur definitely is... Be oh, but Surtur against Nana team. Because this one... Wait. Oh, this is this is ignore effect that resists death. I thought this always like kill, and then the perna doesn't come back. It just resists death. It's not um, extinction. Hmm. But this one is cannot be revived. Wait, cannot be revived. But can this do against works against Nana? I have to try this one. Okay. So that's it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe. Bye.